What is up everyone, Manadad here. It is Tribal Tuesday, and today's tribe is a very exciting one. Standard is getting dominated by this tribe, and that tribe is soldiers. Oh, that's right. Mono white soldiers. We are going to play. So the blue white soldiers and the mono white soldiers were both ranked. And I saw a list of rankings of what is currently in standard the best. They were they were the S tier. <laughs> Two soldier decks. Um, so we're going to do the mono white. It's less wild cards, obviously, because your mana base is going to be simpler. Um, I don't think I had a third Mishra's factory, but otherwise this is a very standard um, list. And you'll see it's very simple. <laughs> four Yoshin soldiers, four lay down arms, four recruitment officers, uh, four guardian of New Banalia, four Thalia guardian of Thraben, four valiant veteran. We're just like in the four of plan here. Four brutal Cathars, four siege veterans. We're just figuring out what's best at each uh, mana value, except we're running three Myrals and one wandering emperor. Uh, 20. Three total, no, 24 total lands. Iganjo, two Mishra's factory foundries, and the planes. And that is the soldier deck. If you like seeing the best tribes in magic every Tuesday here on the channel, we do that. We also just play whatever is fun on Arena or uh, anything in magic in general we're talking about. So I'd uh, love if you hit that subscribe. And as a bonus, I will remind you, you should hit the subscribe because I do give away uh, prizes and things from time to time. So Hit that subscribe, you'll be there when it happens. Um, looking at 1,000 subscribers as a milestone. Help me make it happen, and the rewards will be plentiful. Here we go. Playing Mono White Soldiers. I have to reserve judgment, I guess, on whether white works as a piece in this whole puzzle. But standing alone, I just can't recommend it. That's what I'll play when we lose, I guess. All right, we got memes here now. Keep this. Don't have a turn one play, but you can get Guardian down turn two, Siege down to they, they, They're a soldier deck. Must be the blue-white version. Um, play the Foundry yet. Might need to lay down arms so I can get the planes going. They've got a Thalia. Well, that's fine. Back into my Guardian? Weird. How are they going to wreck me here? I strike officer. Sure. How about I brutally cathar that? Back in. They got a valiant veteran. We can remove that with lay down arms, though. They got another valiant veteran. Sure. Okay, now we have an interesting thing. We could siege veteran. Move one of these guys. So combat. Power this up. Hackers enlist. One attacker listed. Get our scry on. Um, I don't take one planes, I guess. If we really need it. They're down to two cards in hand. Guys great Alpha. A 
we could power up everyone. We could also power up everyone. I think what we want to do is Wandering Emperor here. Plus up the Siege Veteran. Back enlist. Pick pull. <laughs> and uh, they scoop. All right, beating the other top tier soldier deck. Let's go, let's go. Platinum. Okay, been dealing with some technical issues. Hopefully, um, they're fixed. But, uh, anyways, if you stick around to the very end when I go through the win rate of the deck, you'll notice there's some games that have been played since the beginning. We got a one, a two, and a three. A lot of people playing blue-white soldiers against me today. This, however, Grixis. Blood Tide Harvester. I think we'll probably just try and take that out. We'll lay down arms. We're slightly mana if inefficient. We would have loved to get the Siege Veteran down there. Maybe it would have been correct to play the Siege Veteran. And uh... The thing is, they could have taken out our Guardian of Numenalia. Now we can discard Myrel if we have to. We absolutely must. Like we must. How many of those they got? Maybe we should have kept a Yoshin Frontliner to discard. Their harvester, okay. Ouchie wouchie. Mishra's foundry. Well, we don't want to have to discard that, but we could. Although at this point. Yeah, maybe we just let them. We'll enlist, see what we can. Down there. Dark the block, okay. They got some crazy board wipe. They trick it out of us. Oops, a freezer. Draw a card there. That's nice. That's a nice draw. And that's a scoop. Soldiers! A key. Just two lands, but it looks like the good two lands. We are going second. I think I'll come out with the Yoshin Frontliner. It gives a better attack to Thalia if it survives. And uh, we care less if it dies. Green deck could be... Oh, green-white. 
Okay. Looks like it's enchantments. Thalia should be good. No attacks. Hope we get our, uh, and it, and we do. Oh, we want to brew a catheterize. That's probably. We could let them eat the Yoshin frontliner just to get in an attack, or there's no attack for them. I can't drop another creature here. We can brutal Cathar, Cami. We're getting in. Michiko's Reign of Truth. That's pretty good. Got a big trampler. No blocks. We'll take it. We'll smack you back for more. Double spell. Right, you got nothing to Machik. Getting Machiki with it. Oh, okay. Guess they did have something to Machik. A very expensive wedding announcement. Um, we can Myriel, or we could shield Siege Veteran. This is... Okay, because that gives us an attack with that. And, uh... Likely to block the Thalia. Or I guess they are likely to block it. They go to four. Trade a one one for a one one. They have a two two, but we are super wide. Audacity. Think. No matter what here. Could have four. Well, it's going to block it all out. Go ahead, math it up, opponent. Huh? They might have needed a quest to kill some creatures, so that's fine. They're allowed to play it out. My brother didn't know how to concede for like the first, <laughs> I don't know what, several months he played. Oh, did we have fun? Oh, what? Oh, I didn't need to click it. I guess uh, it doesn't matter. Terrible Tuesday. Mono white soldiers. Keeping it simple in the soldierville. I hope we get that third mana. Put the front liner at risk first. Possibly shouldn't have done that because then we could. We can't double spell. This recruitment officer is going to eat a cut down up against black. Where's my uh, black meme? Black is the color of emptiness. I feel it in my soul because I'm an emotional mess. Ah! <laughs> Black That's is the color of style. emptiness. That's I feel it in my soul because I'm an emotional mess. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
that's on loop. Um, I might regret this. They do have cut down. Bit aggressive, maybe, to come out with the foundry. Yeah. A little bit desperate of opponent, though, to march a wretched sorrow for three. The um, exile here. Full transfer. Okay. Looks like it's Esper Control. They fooled us with their first turn Schwamp. Slows the sunset. Maybe, okay, so I definitely shouldn't have used that, knowing they probably had planeswalkers. The definite punt here. Huh. No. They just keep trying to go face. For one. Let's hope it's a land. Getting screwed here on mana. No! This thing is in, my head. in other words, how long of a screw is necessary? Screw. Ah, farewell. Yes, we're brutal Cathar. Keep the pressure on. Lestis, not a concern. Might actually be helpful if they're flipping day to night a lot. I ganjo. Hit this. Try to wandering emperor it. Very annoying. Now you've done it. Hats coming off. I don't think this is the matchup for the soldiers deck here. We I'm just gonna try to block. Oh, that's very lucky for us. We'll poop out another blocker, but we can lay it lay down arms at sorcery speed. Exile. You are not much of a roadblock. Yeah. Filter their hand. Must have a bunch of lands.
Okay. That's Samer. Let's plus up that Samer. In the turn. Hecanuma so they can Wandering Emperor again. This has Vigilance. That keeps the Siege Veteran from attacking though. We did not draw the part of our deck that's really helpful against them. Oh man, another non-token. Okay. Guards, to me. Problem is they're not closing out the game, so we're still in this. Bank Busterino. Bring a card. Possibly removing our token. Wandering Emperor it. No, nope, they don't, though. Oh. Wait, it's not a soldier. Shoot. Oops, I should have put a plus counter on it. Your blade do the talking. Oh, well, that was a mistake. We must the turn. protect the people. Samurai token. And another board wipe, possibly? How long can this go on? A big drain? A big blade claw serpent, sure. Well, they finally found a way to close out the game. So let's just concede. Here we go. Opponent is going first. I don't know. When are we going to get to go first? Have we played first yet? Certainly messes with the win rate of a deck when you can't uh, play first. Rocket Doobity -do Dubos. And exile that, though. Have some life. Graveyard Trespasser. We wish we had. Yeah. PG Veteran. Put it out of cut down range, no attacks. Abla of the Mirror Breaker. Well, the Ganjo is tempting. We lose out on a Siege Veteran plus two.
put both our pluses on the frontliner. They want to trade. They can. We'd like them to do some trades here because we'd like to just keep adding to the board. Mint. Fifths, how many cards? Two lands, okay. They're flooding. The no blocks, they've got Bank Buster, you know, they got a tenacious underdog. We plus up here. I make the siege. They can make their bank buster a four four. Could make the siege veteran a five five. Eat that frontliner. Do you want to eat the frontliner? Go ahead, be my guest. You're taking five. I'm making two soldiers. And the question is do I play Guardian of Nubanalia? I don't think I do. Could be wrong. What you got, Rakdos? Another underdog. Okay. No attacks. Lay down arms. We could ice one of the underdogs. Right, ice the reflection, I think. We're worried about those shenanigans. The bank buster active, sure. I want to get the recruitment officer out of cut down range if we think that's get the siege veteran um, powered up as a blocker. Could be a mistake if they've got removal. I think we're on no attacks.
four mana up, they got to worry about Wanderer. And we've got activation of Recruitment Officer. Yeah, we probably should have taken that out of cut down range. Oh well. <laughs> gonna get us a card before it leaves. It's gonna replace itself before it leaves. Another fable. Jeeba Jeeba. Taking us to Value Town here. Okay. Yet another lay down arms. We could just recruit. Try to find our thing that's gonna. Definitely pausing there. Just have a handful of cutdowns. Go for the throat. Pass the turn. And they can shape their hand here pretty well. Two lands to the graveyard. Land I'm getting played. Blood Tithe Harvester. Not really in endangering any of our key creatures. Only if they played two of them that were in trouble. What you gonna do? You gonna bust your blood token or Hopefully they're freezing so we can play our uh, salty rope animation. You know what a hurry we're in! Salty didn't like it much. I do not suppose you've got to spit things up. Salty? Do it! Salty! Oh, 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 oh. I am only waiting around to kill you. Opponent. I guess we're gonna watch our rope uh, animation again. Okay, I guess not. Um, if they play a blood tithe harvester here, kind of bad. We get in with um. Frontliner and then the whole crew here while we have the chance. Get that out of range, that out of range of the double blood tithe harvester.
Okay, so how did the soldiers do? They did a 63% win rate. Very good. Very respectable. Um, I think I said it, but in case I cut it out, I, you did miss some games because I've been having terrible technical uh, difficulties. But um, anyway, 63%, 67% on the play, 60% on the draw. Pretty good uh, to be able to win on the draw. Shows you just how fast this deck is. If the opponent stumbles at all, we can take advantage of it. Um, we did lose more to blue white soldiers, which is, I guess, considered the other S tier deck in the meta currently um, than we won. But I think, you know, if we played an, an, a bunch of those matches, maybe it would be close to 50% win rate. And as you can see, we're pretty well stacked up against the rest of the meta. I did not feel like the Esper match was a very good one for us, so if more control starts coming in, um, these soldiers might be in trouble. Uh, of course, uh, if you're a better pilot than I am, you might also be able to do better with it. So thanks for joining me here in the attic. I've been Manadad reminding you, magic is a game so fun, even dads can enjoy it. Adios.